So I want to, I think I want to go ahead and build an app with Beat. And, you know, I can start putting my, my query into here for agent mode, but we also have another feature, which is pretty cool, which we've had for a couple months now, uh, called prompt snippets. And so one place I can see this, if I go to add context and prompt, and I can create prompt files by, let's say, prompt. Um, a, a prompt file is basically just um, a file that goes under GitHub dot github slash prompts it's a, a way to kind of create a prompt that i can like reuse i can share it with other people i can check it into my repo i i like to write my prompts in here like especially if i'm setting up a new project because um i'm probably going to write a lot of stuff that just feels you know maybe cramped in here um but then it's also nice to just have this as like an artifact that sort of um you know doc how i created this this repo um and then i can check it in with my code so I created one there, but I'm going to switch over to one that I already um, just have with some basic rules. So I'm just, um, you know, kind of prompting it that I really do want it to go ahead and uh, create the whole thing today. Some some basic rules. This is the the app that I want to do. So I want to do a weather forecast app. I like building weather forecast apps. We want to react to Vite and TSX. And something that I can do, I can even have Copilot kind of help me, like with the process of writing this. And I'm going to say... Oh, cool. Oh, let's see. Open weather map. That's a good idea. Yeah, I want to be able to search for a city name. Um, it's such a big brain move to use Copilot to ask how to prompt Copilot. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, so these are all um, all good rules. I am just going to switch to sort of a pre-baked prompt. Um, I'm only I'm just specifying V631 because V6.4 was released this morning, and this morning my demo from last night did not work. So we're going to stick with what I know is working. So something that's convenient is in my, my prompt file, um, we've got this run button here and I can either just say run the prompt or I can say run new chat. So we say run the prompt. And okay, this is good. I haven't actually used these prompt files before, so this is fun. Yeah. To be clear, I saw that you put the prompts in like a prompt folder and it's like the the dot prompt dot md. Do they have to be named in that way to be able to use these prompts? Yeah, so this is um just where the uh the prompts live in um yeah. slash prompts and then yeah the, the prompt dot md. So this file is kind of a special language. Um and there's a bunch more language features that we're sort of hooking up, um, you know, like the ability to sort of add different types of context and, you know, tools in your prompt. And so those will all light up when you, um, when you use this, um, this naming scheme. And so as it runs, you know, it ran the, um, the terminal command to kind of scaffold the basic repo. And then now it's filling in the files that I, you know, I actually want to, to have my feature. And so we can see these files, these edits coming in, um, as it works, which is nice. And I can see files that it's worked on lighting up here. I can also click these pills to kind of see individual diffs. Um, so like here you can see, um, I think it maybe got a lint error here about, um, about using any. And so when it edited the file first, the first time, you know, then it saw we, the error and it sort of is just auto fixing itself in, in this round. And styles for us, just give it a few more seconds. I'm also using GPT 4.1 right now, which is a brand new model. It's going to start my dev server for me. And I think what's going on is I'm, since I'm, I'm sharing my screen and everything is slowing down, it's not <laughs> what I want, but. Okay, I'm going to um, pull this over. Ooh. And the camera can have. Let's see. Oh, you know, I missed a step. I need to do a little off screen magic to uh, make sure that we have an API key. And you don't get to see that. Dang. Okay, let me try again. Okay. Go! Dang, that was so fast. <laughs>